The escarpment cliffs of the eastern Toronto waterfront are called Scarborough Bluffs. They stretch along the Ontario Lake coastline of the Scarborough District of Toronto. You can see on the video how they look during Canadian autumn. Canadian fall is the most colorful time of the year when trees turn into bright colors ranging from green, to yellow, orange and different shades of red. You can compare the same site in March. January through March are the coldest months in Toronto. In the late 1700s the bluffs were simply called the Highlands. Then they were called the Scarborough Highlands after Scarborough in North Yorkshire. Elizabeth Simcoe, the wife of the first lieutenant governor of Upper Canada chose that name after the limestone cliffs in her hometown. The name Scarborough was later given to the entire town. In the past, the bluffs extended much closer to the Toronto Harbour, but large areas were leveled during urban development. The remaining part continues to shrink due to fast consistent erosion. The soil is sandy and does not hold well against it. The erosion accelerated after residential development on top of the bluffs. The great views became attractive as prime real estate location. The result was faster eroding bluffs and shrinking land properties. In some cases, even houses, when chunks of land were falling into the lake. In 2017, the Toronto Region Conservation Authority initiated the Scarborough Waterfront Project. The plan included work on 11 kilometers of the shoreline. A new beach and erosion control retaining structures were put in place. This allowed stabilization of the base. After that, the top parts continued to erode before they reached a natural slope stability. The Bluffs is a community place with a beach, hiking trails, picnic tables, parking lots, a restaurant, a marina and a boating club. Music